Hey, what's up, Nuganites? I got another fight for you today. This is probably the important one. And I am going to be taking off four very large opponents. But before I go on to the fight, uh, let's go ahead and uh, introduce you to my co announcer. Hey! What's your name, co announcer? Hey! I'm Captain Brushka. I. I'm saying the uh, Russian counterpart of your name, since you tend to use it for Skype and other things. What, what counterpart? What are you talking about? Say Captain Russia in Russian. I no, mean, you, I. You got it translated into Russian on your for Skype. I I can't pronounce that. Okay, well. Simply mode is over. Anywho, um. So, Russia, before we uh, hop onto the fight, anything you want to say, like, um, uh, maybe it is? Yeah, um, the Donkey Kong portrait doesn't properly fit. <laughs> well, that's true. This it's is expand on. Uh, that's it's a expanding really old, order. <laughs> it's a really, really old. Please do not use that. Um, it's, a, it's a bind me. Yeah, this is Axis Donkey Kong, by the way. <laughs> oh, no wonder. Yeah, I actually like fighting against them. It's very satisfying. But let's go on to the fight. I am Quua, yet again. And I am taking on Elephant, I mean Jumbo. I will have to cheese him because he does not fight there. So oh, typical. I can see he's got some hyper armor going on. He's got hyper armor. His butt down has um, invincibility. And there's some grappling hips after the invincibility. Well, I can see you're gonna cheese him the same way I cheese. Uh, the, the same way I would cheese Pink Amina here. Ah, oh, okay. oh, got. Yep. You got hit. You got. You got hit again. Well, I can't exactly get away from this guy. Okay, thankfully he uh, missed me and I got my pipe off. Yeah, I can see what you mean by the collision boxes on these guys. This is not good. Here's an actual fear fighter. Yeah, he's. I thought he was bigger. Uh, he is kind of big. I don't know why he's trying to uh, do the parries. Okay. okay, he's got high damage too. You're going down. Yeah, stay away. What? Uh, gotta hit. Land. Gotta hit the parries. His AI is really good, and he doesn't spam anything at all. No, he just waits for that moment to hit you. Yep. Gotcha. But it wasn't good enough. It's still one. Down by the squirrel. You Man, that we got sawed. You gotta be kidding me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm crazy enough to try it. Ouch. Oh no, this guy is difficult to cheese, and even so, he's... Well, yeah, he's, he's really tough. <laughs> I've tried fighting this guy up plenty of times myself. It's nuts. I've very rarely beaten him. Yeah. Okay, I can get him. Yeah, you got one more life. Okay. Yeah, there we go. I bet he's... Nope, nope, you got him. It's like that one attack hits overhead, yeah. hits under, and then it hits over. And, and those types of attacks are very difficult to dodge. It is. 
It doesn't help the guy's already got a lot of reach and he moves really fast for his size. Plus, Willa's uh, revival there can't work if she gets grabbed. Well, I got beat, but I'm not gonna give up here. Nah, I'm fine. How about, can, am I doing better now? A little bit. I'm gonna have to put her in her palatine. So what's that gonna do? Well, um... For starters, it just doubles up her defense. That way, Zod cannot kill me quicker. And that's about it, really. Oh, well, I, think that, I think that should be... I think it should be sufficient. <laughs> Ow. I wonder I gained this guy from because the way his sprites are cut out looks looks really weird. <laughs> oh yes, it's sometimes a random projectile will But it's not very common. A random projectile whenever you're going to attack. No, it's just random, like, while I'm getting hit. In her palette 9, 10, and 11, they're more uh, common. But in this palette, it's not. So it's technically. Oh, at all that parry action. I know. And it seems that her double defense isn't doing much. It probably doesn't against those. It's kind of... Ouch. Well, take this Ouch. from a guy who knows how to code. Yep. You're doing quite well. It's kind of difficult... Oh, there's a health region. Um, It's kind of difficult to actually lower damage done by throws. Yeah, the only way I know to do it is to alter the defense. Oh, what? But, but even that doesn't work sometimes. These characters can use an absolute value to avoid it. This is why in a lot of the cheesy edits I've done in the past, when characters get thrown, they sometimes don't take any damage. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, so for a guy with no special moves, it's quite impressive. <laughs> well, I mean, he does have them, he just doesn't have any hypers, there's nothing special. Nothing super hidden in there. Yep, got him finally. Now that was kind of close. It was, his he was gonna was right. give you a second time. Oh, it's this guy, it's the guy. Donkey Kong, who is an edit of... Pretty this guy's a sprite much. edit of somebody. Who is it? No, I know, it's Hulk. It's Hulk. <laughs> oh, it's Hulk? Yeah, it's Hulk. <laughs> Knock it off, Donkey Kong. I want to fight you fairly. Oh, nice combo. <laughs> yeah, it's something I learned along the way. This is actually my most favorite character from Nugent. It's too bad she's just loaded with a bunch of light attacks. She has no heads at all. But is she fast? She's definitely fast. Combos a lot. Well, there's no... There was nothing wrong with that. I mean, if you've ever played, like, a Shiki Tono character, they're fast. He's fast, but he doesn't really have heavy attacks. But the thing is, though, she doesn't have a push shield. She doesn't have an air recovery, and she does not have a counter. What she does, but it takes a high hyper bar and it's really really bad so, it sounds like another character i know never want to use that counter well the reason why i can use her is that i can set traps on the ground which i don't i don't really bother and i can almost infinitely juggle people with her sunflower stalks but i prefer I I not to do that because that's really cheap uh, mm, all right i have defeated Opponents like, um, oh, let's see here. Oh, me man is gonna hate me for this. Oh, I know where this is going. Yeah, I got Gorilla Cross. 
Um, don't you mean, don't you mean that other gorilla? <laughs> um, not Harambe, I assure you. <laughs> or at least not the Harambe head. No, this is evil dog. No. Oh, I thought I have defeated him with Bula. Because what he does, uh, by the way, this is the uh, evil Donald with the Donald Desu AI patch. Making him far tougher. This will be the last fight uh, moving Edas and moving Knights that I'm going uh, to cut off here. Wait. This, wait. Evil Donald has an AI patch and I never knew about this? Yes. It's by Donald Desu. And I'm going to have to go with Palette 8. Uh, well, good luck then. Because, because I always commended Donald Dead to yeah. Ronald McDonald for having some of the best AI I think I've ever seen. Or best AI in the fact that he can just combo you perfectly to no end. <laughs> now, Ronald McDonald's AI is virtually <laughs> flawless. <laughs> He's like the only Ronald McDonald that I think is actually worth keeping outside of collectors. <laughs> Except for maybe Dark Donald and, and this Donald, but you get the idea. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, he is a lot tougher now. Yeah, uh, B-Man said that he get, he's got major respect for me for actually using this. Because I wasn't really afraid to fight him like this. I could not get him with Tetsu at all. And that's like my best character. Ooh, okay. Where exactly did you find this patch? Um, I just googled it, and it popped up in the search. Well, as soon as he lets me land, I'll probably be able to get him. Oh, phew, well, that's just great. Come on, just a few more hits. Just one more hit! Mm. Hmm. Yes. No. Jesus. No. He's too fast. Dang, I want glam. No. Yeah, the French fries trapped me. I couldn't get out. Like I said, she has That's... no counters, and I have it's no so way of dodging close. that. so close. So close. Hmm. The uppercut, man, it's really hard to get past. What uppercut? You mean that one? It's that? the Vanessa. It's the Vanessa uppercut from the Fighters. Vanessa does that exact same one. Well, you mean that grab move? <laughs> no, it's a, it's an actual uppercut. That's the grab move. That one. Because, what, you mean the one where you hit you three times while punching up? <laughs> yeah, that one oh, right there. Uh, oh, that one! Yep, that's okay. Vanessa's uppercut. Uh, Donald doesn't have any actual attacks of his own. Well, considering the guy is, one, a sprite edit of, of, of Dio from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, and two, he has, and two, he has a lot of, yeah, he has a lot of moves based off a lot of other guys, including Dio, also Rugal, um, I think a few other people. Gotcha. Oh, good finish. I had to run up and uppercut him just to make sure he wouldn't get back at him. It's still a really good character, but, um, it's still a really pretty good character overall. Would rather have it exist than not exist. <laughs> now, what I rather would not have exist 
is the never-ending supply of stupidly named edits out there. Hey, Rio's the same way, dude. Ryu I'm saying and Vega. Well, yeah, but but they're not stupidly named. I mean, I literally found out about this raw McDonald like about 30 minutes ago called Black Tea, Black Tea Pepper Donald or something like that. <laughs> You don't want to tell me that's not stupidly named? <laughs> when it has nothing to do with the title? Names don't really matter. It depends on the edits. In my opinion. Uh, some of them are good. Most notably the A-plus series. See, I, I'm in that infinite juggle. Oh, wow. I thought I got out of it. What an added man. There goes the rocket. Got him. Oh, Come on. Freaking assist. He eats projectiles. Well, you see, that's the problem. That is the problem with Bryon that everyone hates. <laughs> I actually did beat Ryan once, and I can't believe I pulled it off. <laughs> I beat him with a balanced character. <laughs> now that was close. Yeah, look at those health bars. Those are way too close. <laughs> well, BM, I hope you got mad respect for me there. <laughs> I beat your evil Donald on the Paladate. This is not the super cheap Paladate. The super cheap Paladate is like 9, 10, or 11. And 12 is just God made. Well, this well, is, uh... Oh, go ahead. Well, no one outside of a super herber cheesy, but, but basically, yes. This evil Domo does not really have a god tier palette at all, is what I found out. But what, uh, he, can, can. But what he can do is uh, keep generating power bars. He gets infinite power bars on his full well, palette. He, what about his insane mode? Did you forget about that? Yeah, he activates that, in which he... Pretty much combos you forever, but still, he, he's not like uh, unbeatable still. Hmm. Anyway, this is Book Loud 735 signing off. Good. And Captain Russia has said he's done yawning. Hey, we we'll get in the kitchen all next time. Until next time, Moganitos and Moganites. See ya.